Boy, I hope this rain quits soon. My package will be in day after tomorrow. And I would like it for it to be not raining so I can assemble that e-bike outside. But we will see. Well, it's showing cloudy today, and let's hope tomorrow, like it says, it's going to be sunny. The bike should be here tomorrow, and we can get it unpacked and put together. For right now, I got these guys outside. They got some new food that just came in. Um, it's for cleaning their teeth, because I have tried to brush their teeth, and it does not work. Well, I brought these guys inside because the clouds rolled in pretty thick. Look like it might start raining. I hope it don't. It says no rain today, just cloudy, but tomorrow will be sunny. And uh, that way I can put that bike together outside. Uh, if it is raining when the bike comes in, uh, I'm going to talk to the gentleman that owns the cabin and see if I can put it together on the inside there. Uh, they have a mud room where I'll be out of the rain at least. All right, we'll check back in tomorrow. There it is, time to unwrap. We're taking a little ride. This is an upgrade where I'm riding at right now. It's a slight upgrade, not big, but uh, bike goes real smooth on it. You guys have seen my other videos where I'm riding my regular mountain bike out here, but this is a, a, a slight upgrade for about a mile. And boy, this just picks up and goes. You can see Right now I'm pedaling, going nine miles an hour. And it's very easy, uh, this bike is very easy to ride. I've only rode one other electric bike, so I can't really compare. But I would say this is a very good e-bike. I mean, for me, it's excellent. Those of, a those of you guys that follow my channel know that I ride my bike for exercise. I have a a bad heart only 30% of my heart works and I have a pacemaker so I exercise I get cardio exercise riding that bike but on this upgrade I can't ride the whole upgrade usually but with this I can pedal I'm pedaling full right now and I can get up this upgrade up, up to the edge of the mountain there just about there's a few houses at the end of this road 
but yeah this thing is smooth easy to operate um, yeah I can't say anything bad about this bike been raining all morning quit raining for a little bit so we're gonna ride it for a mile or two here now if I gun it if I put all the power into it I can get it up to ride at 20 on this upgrade we're at 18 right now 19 it's going, yeah, there we go, 20 miles an hour on this upgrade, and I'm a big girl, I'm telling you. So, it carries my weight excellent. I think uh, it carries 245 pounds, up to 245 pounds, and my buddy that I just let ride it, he weighs a little bit over that, and it ran fine with him. It took him 20 miles an hour up this upgrade. And so this is getting more steeper of a hill here. Woo, it's getting cold. I'm going to turn around here in a few minutes. It's cold. We'll turn around at this circle here. Yeah, this thing runs pretty good very smooth ride easy to operate like i said so if you're new to having a e-bike this is a good one this is definitely a good one easy handling the brakes work excellent i'll show you we're going 20 miles an hour we'll come to a stop that's how fast i can stop it that's pretty good at 20 miles an hour It's cold. <laughs> These big tires make for a smooth ride, I tell you make for a real smooth ride they're 20 by fours and uh, we'll talk a little bit more about those when we get back to the van all right guys I snuck in out of the rain it's coming down pretty good you may hear it hitting the top of the van let's talk a little bit about what the fifth wheel thunder ft1 has to offer First and foremost, these tires are amazing. All-terrain tires, sand, snow, concrete, pavement, uh, mud. I rode it in mud and on pavement and in dirt, and it was fine. They're all-terrain tires, 20-inch wheel with a 4-inch tire. So check those tires out. A uh, very, very uh, good feature on this bike. Before we go any further, do I do want to say I've never owned an e-bike. I've only rode two. And so I can't compare to another e-bike with this one, but I can say this is an awesome bike. Okay, this has a 500 watt powerful motor. It has a six speed Shimano gear. It also will go up to 20 miles an hour. Very smooth shifting, very easy to ride, very easy to pedal just without even using the motor. It's awesome, awesome riding bike. Okay, on to the battery. It has a 48 volt battery, a 10.4 amp hour, um, it will go 31 to 51 miles, depending on how much you assist the pedal. And one thing I really like about this battery is removable. It has a key that locks it into the bike. You can take the battery out. And uh, that's that's something I really liked about it. Okay, onto the shocks. It has dual shock absorbers. Makes it comfortable on all terrain. I definitely think you guys are going to like this feature on the bike. Another awesome feature about this bike is it folds in half. 29.5 high 22.8 wide, 39.4 inches long. So this folds down quite small. You can fit it in your trunk, most most car trunks. 
Um, it sits right up where my passenger seat would be in my van. If I had one there, I can set it right there with no problem folded down. Okay, it has mechanical disc brakes, aluminum alloy frame, 65.3 pounds. Front headlight runs off the battery. The back tail light runs on batteries. You can turn it on and off. And it takes four to five hours to charge the battery. It was packaged excellent. Uh, easy to unpack, but they wrapped it up very well. Uh, nothing could have got really hurt in that in the packaging at all. And uh, assembly time, me and my friend assembled it in less than 45 minutes. But I did not put the fenders on. Um, I didn't want them on right now. And I did not put the little uh, bell on, like the little ringer bell, like a horn. I didn't put that on. But it took us under 45 minutes, two of us putting it together. Easy to assemble the toolkit that's with it. You don't need any other tools. Uh, the toolkit with it takes care of everything. So yes, it was definitely an easy assemble. All right, guys, here is a discount code for you. It will be down below with the link to the website down below. Check it out. Uh, after the 28th, November 28th, th this will, won't be as much of a discount. So go check it out. Christmas is coming up. Get your significant other or kids or whatever, an e-bike. I think you guys are going to dig this one. I definitely enjoy riding it. Can't wait for this bad weather to stop so I can get out and ride it some more. Uh, thank you at Fifth Wheel E-Bikes, Jesse, for all your help. Awesome customer service, folks. Uh, their customer service is great. You'll get a warranty with the bike, too. Check all that out on the website. Okay, that's all for me. Take care of yourselves. Take care of each other. Peace out. Peace out.